Hey guys, Rachel and Gome here, Five Star Diamond Beachbody Coach, and today I'm going to be talking to you about Canva and how to create awesome, awesome images. So there's a couple different websites that you can use for images. I love Canva. It's free for the most part. Otherwise, you can create images using their graphics for super duper cheap. Um, usually just a dollar for a graphic and I use this for everything and the reason why I really do love it is because all the images that I've made in the past are saved here and so I could always click in here and edit so let's say I want to check out this image this is something that I've already made before I can resave it I can edit it if I had like a date on here I could do that I can also click this button here to duplicate an image and I could easily edit it here if I didn't want to change this. So that's one of the really cool features. Um, so depending on what kind of graphic you want to make. So if you want to make something for YouTube, let's say here's an example of an image that I made with YouTube. So you can kind of see because you guys social media, it's busy and you want to create images that are going to get people's attention. You want them to be bright and you want people to to take notice of you, right? So I use fonts that are easy to read. I use images that um, will get people's attention, right? And colors that will get people's attention too. So you could create posters, social media. This is a square image. So you could easily create images here. This is perfect for Instagram, right? Um, you could create Im graphics for your blog. Um, here's another Instagram. This is how I create Facebook event covers. There's so much you can do in Canva. It really is like mind blowing. Uh, I everything that I'm doing for my ebook too. I do this here as well. Um, you can see like everything, everything. <laughs> There's so if you're doing Facebook ads, so it has like all the right dimensions too. Another cool thing, I just clicked on this explore templates. So there's all these different templates here that you can just be kind of creative and start creating um, different things. So I'll show you something that I made using a Canva template. Let's look at my designs. Okay. So here's something that I've done for my future challengers. So people send me, you know, the, a questionnaire answering their health and fitness goals and I used a Canva resume template to input their goals. This is so freaking cool. So this gives them a custom recommendation. And I did that on Canva and I did it for one person. And then all I have to do is go in here and edit it and it's already saved. So I don't have to like recreate the wheel or anything like that. I love that feature. Okay. Um, gosh, you could do, so I've done all of these. Here's another thing that I did for our business, right? This is again a Canva template, a resume template, and I just got a little creative and made it so it would be an inviting tracker. Something that's easy to duplicate for our team. And you could save this, download it in a PDF version, you could share it with people. These are all the different templates that you can use and just input it with your own information. I do meal plans in here. So you'll see once you get a copy of my ebook, you'll see um, all the different meal plans that I've created. I do our graphics for our recognition in here as well. I wanna do like little fun graphics. So if you go to the explore templates, gosh, you could go social graphics. Let's see. Well, what's one that I would wanna do? I could easily just search here too, motivation. And this is giving, obviously you could search for this on Google too, but if you wanna put your logo on it, you wanna put this on Pinterest or something like that. Uh, here's some, there, it, I mean, these are free and they already have quotes on it and everything. You can just put your logo down there, so cool. So obviously there's a lot of different things that you can do with this. If you're creating graphics for Pinterest, these tall skinny, skinny images end up working best. Those are, I'll show you an example of my most repinned image that gets me, I have over a thousand people visiting my blog every single day and it blows my mind. Um, but images like this with my before and after picture on Pinterest works really, really well. This graphic, it's long, skinny, and bright color. That works really well as well. 
well, well. <laughs> I do, um, again, more recognition pictures. This graphic has been repinned a ton as well. What is the keto diet? Very straightforward, easy to read. Where's my peanut butter fat bomb? You can see I've done so much here. It's awesome. Where did you go, fat bomb? And obviously you can upload your own pictures to this too. Let me show you that feature in a second. Da, 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 da. This one is an example. So I uploaded right here. You can go to uploads and this is, these all stay. That's like the coolest thing. You could upload as many images as you want and they all stay right here and you can just edit. So I'll just make a copy of this peanut butter fat bomb. If I wanted to add, show a chocolate one, just delete that. Boom, right? How easy is that? That is so cool. I'll leave, I don't wanna save that. But that's just Canva, like super brief tutorial. Um, dude, yeah, I use this seriously like every single day, every single day. Um, so I hope that helps. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below this video and I'd be happy to help. Have an awesome day and I'll talk to you later, bye.